Hello, tarantulites, and welcome to another rant and rave with your favorite old fave, Dave Bid Contreras, aka Eso Derica. And it's uh, December 2017, and we're nearing, if not in, the holiday season. And isn't that a blast? Oh, yeah, it's great. I know. I should be more thankful because I have family and friends and blah, blah, blah. But those things, they cost money. Are you kidding? This is Los Angeles. People are very materialistic. If you're not buying them a present over $100, guess where it's going to end up? In their sidewalk sale in January or the thrift or secondhand stores. Yes, that's a good time to get some $40 Christmas gifts in January in Los Angeles. You heard it from... Straight from the horse's mouth. <laughs> horse, that's right, horse. And I'm working old age rosacea because I don't have enough uh, dimes to go to that damn clinic and get some creams or something. This cold weather is making my white skin even whiter or redder or something. I'm giving you Santa Claus this season. Yeah, this season makes me, you know, kind of want to join Jehovah's Witness or some other uh, group. You know, where you're so cheap and you don't have to give gifts. Oh, dream come true. Why don't they put that religion in it? It's all money. Everyone says, oh, it's the gifts. It's not the gifts that count. It's the thoughts and blah, blah, blah. Wake up. Ding, ding. This is Los Angeles. People are materialistic. Deal with it. The other other uh, Christmas, I told my friend, oh, my God, you didn't have to. I didn't give you a gift. And she said, oh, good. I'm going to give this Prada wallet to my brother. He would like it a lot more anyway. Huh. So there I was without a Prada wallet because I didn't have a return gift. And imagine if I would have had a return gift, it would have been $25 for the movie house anyway. So she would end up taking the Prada wallet back. Lord knows they're not $25. Yeah, it's, it's not that I'm cheap. Well, yeah, I am cheap. But I'm old and I can't find a job. Do you know that there is a thing called old age prejudice? Yes, there is. Me I'm okay. I'm the hottest and youngest of my neighborhood telling you how old those bitches are, honey. They's old. I mean, real old. Like the old, they're limping around and like dragging that one good leg. They look like they've been through the mill, but not through the mill once, like twice. And the mill broke the gears on their bones because they went so many times, gear. I mean, they look toe up. Oh, and then they come, God bless it, you know whatever but they get this food from a store <laughs> which were named nameless that gives away their old stuff like ready to be expired girl this old carcass doesn't need other old carcass in it unless you know it's a good time in it but i mean not like ingesting i mean that imagine what it's going to do to my intestinal tract do I look 20? No. Imagine, but that meat does. That meat looks 20 years old. I'm going to put that in my mouth. And they're like, oh, we have eggs and this and that. I'm all, oh, yeah, good, great, yeah, because I want to walk around crawling like you or something. No, no, thank you, darlings. Mm -mm, I just can't do it. Oh, look, Christmas song. In a pear tree. Ugh, where's my gun when I need it? That's when guns should be legal to shoot that damn Christmas music. Gung, 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 gung. Anyway, yeah, I, you know, I could get a job. I could be like a hairdresser or a microbiologist, <gasps> a makeup artist. There's only one problem. I can't see. Yeah, your eyes go when you get old. Yeah, one of the many things that you don't want to go, go. And the things you don't want to come, i.e. hair on your chest and ears and nose and everything that comes but your sight your sex drive your everything all fun hair goes and it leaves you with all handicapped ish so yeah i my eyes are so bad i have those two o'clock in the morning eyes when you're downing the beer and everyone's looking good because you have beer goggles on well that's my daily eyesight and then I have reading, which is even more so, it's even too strong. I could see like the amoebas and paramecium's and other microbiology stuff having sex on my glasses lens. Ew. Trust me, you want to wash your sheets a little bit more than usual. Anyway, yeah, it's the Christmas season or Hanukkah or Kwanzaa or this or that. 
Oh, honey, it all started off with the pagans. They were having a damn good time after reaping and sowing all kind of things, you know, fruits and vegetables and all that. And then at the end, they would make wine and have orgies all night welcoming the, you know, the winter solstice or whatever. Well, if that was the case, then yeah, maybe. But no, now we have ghetto bitches fighting on Walmart for an ugly two for ten tank. Like, oh, really? I mean, go to my website and buy something for crying out loud. Then you can stop hearing this old man crying about his rusted years, which should be the golden years. You know, I mean, I just want to make those couture gowns that look like a fabulous cocoon that you could barely walk and only one person in the whole world wants to buy it. Yes, that's what I want to do. But alas, I'm making like 10 five and dime stuff that, you know, I guess nobody wants because here I am begging for money. Oh, I wish my arms or limbs or ears or what? What? Oh, I, even I wish my earring worked too. Lord knows my eyes don't and my ears don't. And if I have to pick up that heavy box, my back doesn't. <laughs> anyway, it was just so Wonderful, letting all this off of my old chest onto your little young ears. Because Lord knows, if you're old, you're not listening to the podcast. You don't know how to click on the damn link that I put. I mean, I don't know what else to do but to click it for you. Maybe I need a YouTube video on how to find my YouTube video. Ugh. Anyway, I think our generation's getting lost in the cracks. Trust me, I know people. Hold on to your underwear, babies. That don't even have an email. Hello, ring ring. It's a two thousands. Hello, get a get a clue, honey. Something. Everyone's all into the. I don't know when they're into, but honey, they ain't into the computer. They're oh, I don't know. Did it? Yeah, but look, they have a job. Maybe that's the trick. I should get off the computer and do some kind of. I don't know. Clean the toilet. Honey, you don't want me to clean the toilet. I can't see, okay? I'm going to be leaving some chunks around. And when you go to sit down, guess what you're going to sit on? Hmm, a chunk of something that I couldn't see. Oh, if you got any suggestions or any rants or raves or suggestions that I should talk about, if not, enjoy the holiday season. Get a little really drunk. Have lots of sex. Go to church if you have to, only to pick up probably. That's what... I guess straight people do. I don't know. And make the Yuletide gay by wearing a pink outfit, honey. Pink outfit. Make the Yuletide. Oh, you don't get it. Anyway, see why I should keep my day job. This is Dave, your fave, ranting and rave in the cave, saying happy holidays 2017 and may 2018 kick 2017's ass. See you later.